No, it's good afternoon actually. We're heading into the afternoon here. My husband's got the barbecue on and it's my last pour for the day, um, using up some paints that I have left. And um, then I will pack away my stuff for a few days because we're heading on a holiday, but probably by the time you see this video, we will be back. I've got videos all ready to go out every day while I'm away. So I can sit and watch and um, comment back to and forward with you while I'm relaxing, looking over the beach or the ocean. So here we go. I've got some colours that I'm going to see if I can try and make something nice out of them. I have a Viridian Green. So I think I'm going to keep the two a little bit different. Um, I think so. I will use, so I'm going to just put some white in that and and then I'll go with this. This was the custom one I made, which I'm called Emerald Coast. This was the um, metallic gold with just a little bit of, um, no, it was, yeah, metallic gold with a little bit of cool blue. So, that in there, put some more of the Viridian. It's gone, a bit more white. Um, I might put this peach, it's like a peachy orange. I think it was called coral. So I think that will go, still go nice with those greens and then some of my really nice bright orange. Definitely gonna keep it two different cup colors. See how that works out. Um, go back to the orange and some white to finish it off. Start with some white in there and I will use my Berry Delicious in the next cup and then I will, I've got a bit of that, but a little bit of the emerald green Emerald green naturally goes lovely with that. Very delicious, I must say. So I've got that. Um, got any more of the Viridian? Tiny weeny bit left. Don't seem to do many flip cups of late. I'll try some of the orange. Oh, this is very thick. And I have got some of my Razzle Dazzle Red, which was cool red with a good bit of metallic copper. And it is just the most glorious. It's like the candy apple red that they build the cars in. It's very nice. Very nice. So I'll use up these last few colours. Then my tray is empty to go away and um, not have no paints left here, which is a good thing. So I don't, I'm not sure what this particular mix would uh, is gonna come out like because they weren't mixed purpose, purposely mixed for this particular pour, that's for sure. So use the last of that, last of that. All gone. Um, Put a little bit more, a little bit more of my pre-mix white. Ooh. All of the paints are mixed up how I would normally mix my acrylic paints and that is in the drop down box, the description, along with links to the videos that show me making these. So that's the last of that. Just gonna clean my bottle out. Rightio. Oh, I actually did mean to save some. So what I'm gonna do is flip cups. So here we go. See what we get out of these. I would have liked, oh, I can still use my navy. I just wanted to split the two colors up. So I'm gonna put a bit of navy. This is just the same, pre-mixed my acrylics just in these one liter bottles, just makes it a lot easier when you're um, 
doing this so you don't have to keep mixing your paints up every time they're already pre-mixed that's very thick actually I'm gonna have to add something to that that's very thick so let's see the colors look absolutely gorgeous Wow oh my goodness look at this no silicon in these no silicon wow 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 that's very thick i'm a bit worried about that very thick bottom uh, blue navy i'll have to thin that down with a bit of water in my container i think or floatron maybe a bit of floatron Wowzers trousers. Flipping cups, flipping cups. Let's just take this nice and easy to just gently, gently tilt it. That red is just shimmering through there, my razzle dazzle red. It's a custom colour. Nice and slow, no hurry. Just covering the canvas. Bring it all back, recenter it. Wow, look at that. <laughs> That's unbelievable. That navy is definitely way, way, way too thick because it's hardly moving, but it is kind of creating a good barrier for the two sides, I must admit. But I'm pretty sure now that these colors will roll over that navy when I go back to the right. Try and recenter them again and then head back roll over it's just nice easy relaxing for to do oops it's taken it slow. Well, that was a mudge podge of colours for sure, but so far so good. <laughs> Not too bad. This green is gorgeous. It's, it's take it nice and easy when you're tilting. There's no, yeah. Otherwise, you can end up making it real muddy try and you know go hell for the leather I'm trying to Let's see if I can cover this dark blue a bit more down the bottom here I'm on my right I can smell the barbecue going I've got some nice satay chicken on there and we got some steak and sausages and I'm so looking forward to it tonight oh Probably went a bit quick there, bringing it all back. Wow, wow, wow. Now, this is where I've had loads of people say, why aren't you trying the marble thing? I suppose now would be a good time to roll a marble round in this to see what it did, but I don't really want to, no, not today. Not today, Josephine. I will get my um, heat gun, my heat wand and let I was just going merrily along. I'm not sure where I've got to, but my camera stopped again. So I did the pour and went through with the marble. And this is my end result. I'm so annoyed that my camera stopped again, but 
nothing I can do about it now. So please wait on, I'll allow it to dry and I'll put some photos on at the end. And so I hoped you enjoyed um, me losing my marbles, had a go. It probably isn't even on the video. I have to double check it when I get it, my video all down off the duvalaki. Um, stay safe guys, have a really good week. Keep active, keep doing things that give you joy and um, enjoy your art if that's what you're doing or enjoy your exercise or your gardening. Do something that gives you joy. So I will be back again tomorrow with another crazy episode. Um, so until then, I will bid you goodbye for now and just wait on for the photos at the end.